Hey beauties, what's up? I know, it's your girl, Janae Antoinette. I know, I've been long time no see again. I thought I said in the last video that I was gonna get better at this. And I think this time I was even longer. But anyways, I'm here today and I'm here with an exciting video. You can already tell from the title. Um, yes, I fangirled. Um, and I'm not even a real big Rihanna fan. I just like her. But I fangirled over her new makeup line, Fenty. And yesterday I went and got it. But, um, I didn't go early in the morning, um, like, cause I was like, it's probably not going to sell out. Well, at first I thought I was like, man, it's probably going to sell out. I have to work. I'm not going to get my hands on it, whatever. I'll order it online. And then when I went to work, cause I actually work in the mall, um, I walked down there before Sephora was open and it was only like five girls in line. So I was like, oh, I'll just like, I'll be able to, um, go check it out on my break. And because I was like, it wasn't that many people in line. And I was shocked because I'm like, seriously, guys, we're going to do this to Rihanna? Like, come on now. She just said she released 40 shades. Where's my million girls? Like, where are they? But um, when I went down there on my break, I guess my million girls came through. Because my shade in the foundation, it was so out. I was so hurt. So I was like, okay, whatever. Um, I still picked up a lot of things. Um, and I actually got a sample of my shade, um, which is the 420. So I'm going to be using a sample. I'm so sad that I don't have the foundation to show y'all. Because it came in such a beautiful bottle. And it was only $32. So this makeup is very, very, very affordable. Um, but when I do this video, I can't believe I'm even doing a beauty video. I said I was not going to make my makeup, my channel about makeup. Because I'm not really that good at makeup. And um, I was like, I can't do this. And I don't want to go on the camera without the makeup and all of this. But I'm doing it. I can't believe I'm doing it. Um... You're not going to see a lot of these because I'm not the makeup guru. I can't. And I'm on here and I'm looking a mess because I'm going to actually put the makeup on in the video. And I'm going to combine it with products I always use, some of my favorites. Because I can't give you a true review if I just did only um, fancy um, makeup because that's not how I would do my makeup every day. Like you don't wear more than likely you don't wear one brand of makeup like you usually mix it so that's what I'm gonna do so I didn't get her whole line I just got some of the stuff and I'll just show you what I did get as we go along but um, I already kind of did my eyebrows um, the best to my ability because I need to get them done girl but I tried to hide some of the hairs with some concealer so whatever, don't mind that. And I already primed my face. Um, I used the Marc Jacobs primer. Um, so now I'm going to go in with the foundation. Hopefully this is even my color. Because um, when we test, I went in thinking I was going to be a 430. Because I saw JJ Beauty. Um, Jenny Jenkins. She had a 430. And I was like, usually I get her color. So, but when I went in and we tested that, which that was sold out too, Mill and Girls came through. Um, we tested that, that was too dark. And then he put 410 on me. 410 was sold out as well. And 410, it looked like it was good, but I wanted to try 420 because I was like, uh, I don't think I like 410 and 430 is too dark. So I'm going to try the one in the middle. Um, which was 420 which was sold out as well and then he gave me a sample of all of them though but today I'm going to be trying 420 for the video and if I like it yeah I'm going to go ahead and order it online so let's see guys um I only ever use one foundation in my whole life let's see we're going to pour it on my hand on the back of my hand this foundation is supposed to be matte. I usually don't really like really, really, really matte foundations. Because um, I like to look dewy. Um, it is kind of watery, liquidy. 
So I was like, how's it matte? But it's really, it's kind of liquidy. But we gonna see. When I asked the man in Sephora what his honest review about this makeup was, this um foundation, he said that it was like nothing that he um he seen before. So hopefully he just wasn't saying that because he works there. But we about to see. We about to see. Let me spray my brush with some Fix Plus. Let's see, ladies. I'm probably not going to talk that much in this video. And you're going to see me looking past, like not in the camera. Um, because I'm actually looking at my mirror. Because I told y'all, I'm not, I'm not a guru. I don't, I don't know how they do them these makeup videos okay so while I was in the middle of um, trying to blend the foundation in my camera said memory full so I had to actually um, finish blending out off the camera because the foundation it was drying really really fast <clears throat> so I didn't want to um wait so I was like you know what I went in with my beauty blender and um I just went ahead and finished blending my foundation what I think about the foundation it's very very light um it don't feel heavy at all um it isn't cakey on my face so I really like that um it's um <clears throat> it's a medium coverage if you ask me i really like full um full coverage foundation but it is very buildable like you've been hearing everyone say so i really really do agree it um it's supposed to oxidize within my skin so i'm gonna wait and see like how i love it later to give you like a true true review because right now i'm like oh it's okay but also, you have to think, I only ever wore one foundation, so I'm used to that. So, y'all let me know what y'all think about it on me. Um, so, let's see, to see if I'll make the investment and go ahead and buy it. Um, but, on to the next thing I got. I got the Fenty Beauty Matchsticks Trio. And it's supposed to conceal, contour, and highlight. I thought this was so cool. Like, you got this. For $52 where else if you bought the highlights and the concealer sticks and all of that alone they were $24 so I'm like that's not bad at all like you can't beat it so let's go ahead and open this so the color <clears throat> I got the deep one look at this how cute how cute are these? They magnets. Like, that is super cute. Nobody else did this yet. So, I thought that was really, really cute of her packaging. And I think, like, when you're throwing them, like, in your purse or something, they're perfect. Like, you could just throw them in your bag. And they're all stuck together. Oh, my God. My hands are so dirty. So, I want to say the... Sway is the contour stick. Um, the contour stick, I think, I mean, this is not the contour stick. This I have the Sway here, right here. The Sway is what you're supposed to use to highlight. I'm not really a fan of this highlight, but I'm going to use it, but I am going to mix it. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to mix this, so let's see. I'm just gonna put a little of my Kat Von D concealer on because I'm just so used to this as my concealer that I don't know it just wouldn't be right <laughs> it doesn't move the reason I didn't really like her is because alone it wasn't moving like it didn't really move it seemed hard to blend 
And I had already heard that on other videos that I was watching. And when I watched other videos, I didn't really like um, when they were using the highlight. So I was like, mm, I don't think I'm going to really like that. But since it came in the packet, I am going to use it. Um, I am going to set my um, concealer with my Sasha Buttercup Powder. That's what I'm doing right now. Let's grab that contour stick. Now, I am loving that contour stick. Like this. Uh, I can't get over this packaging. It is so cute. My hands are so dirty. This is why I don't do makeup on camera because I'm everywhere. This packaging is so cute and I'm getting it so dirty. And I love the little FB at the top of it. That's really cute. But her contour stick, it came with Espresso. Ugh. I think this is going to be it. I usually use Bobbi Brown to contour. Let's see. I love how this came out so smooth. Unlike the um, concealer, the concealer didn't come out really smooth. So then now I'm going to go in with her. This is her highlighting stick. Y'all, I love these highlighter sticks. They are so pretty. And I actually got two of them. I got the um, rum as well. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to mix these today. Because I didn't get a highlighter. And to be honest, why I didn't get like the powder, the, I guess that's the powder highlighter. Um, because to me, it wasn't something that I needed because I have so many highlighters. And I don't even reach for the highlighters that I do have. I only go for my, like my Bobbi Brown or my Anastasia Peach Nectar. So I was like, I don't have none of these. So I'll get this instead. Because I don't know. You can use these on your body as well because it says these are the matchstick shimmer um, skin stick and you can use it on your eyes, on your body, like anywhere you want. So I think this is pretty cool. Let's see how it works. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I told y'all I do my makeup the same every day. So a lot of people don't use blush no more, but I still use blush. So. went ahead and um put on my lashes and some eyeliner am i the only one who been doing makeup like most of their um adult life and still don't know how to put on lashes like this is crazy as many videos as i watch and they keep on saying it's gonna be easier this has not got easier i cannot do lashes it take me a whole 10 minutes <laughs> longer than that but anyways back into um what we're here for which is these highlighter sticks. So I'm gonna mix both of these. So let's start with the cinnamon first. Let's see. Oh yeah. Yeah, I got the brush to go with it. I sure did. Cause I ain't never had um a stick highlighter. So I was like, I might as well get a get the brush. And the brush the packaging is so cute you can just throw it in your purse and it's magnet with it that's so cute but yeah i already had tried it out on my sister so it's a little dirty but let's go ahead let's grab that cinnamon cinnamon it's just spelled with an s mm. 
we're gonna go ahead and dab it on like that first see how i like that i love it already oh my god but i go in with highlighter so y'all i'm gonna spray my brush with a little fix plus and we're about to get some of this highlighter Okay. Uh, y'all see that? Do y'all see that? Uh, <laughs> I am loving this. Yeah, I'm about to go in with this. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. I'm about to go in. Like, I love me a glow. Don't be surprised if I use this whole thing today. <laughs> no, okay. I ain't gonna use the old thing today, but let's see how much is it. Okay. It's a pretty decent amount. Yeah, it's a pretty decent amount. I'm not even gonna go all the way up. But yes. I'm gonna go ahead down my nose. Yeah, boy. I like when my nose is shining, boy. I love a Rudolph the Red Nose the Reindeer Nose. Y'all see this? I hope it's coming off on the camera how it is on me. Then I'm gonna go ahead and put some under my brow bone. Even though my brows is a mess. Cupid's bow. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and add some of the rum in there with it. Yes, we are. Let's go ahead and mix it in. Make it look like the melon is popping, baby. Before I knew that the trio had um, the same highlighters in there, I thought it just had another highlighter in there. I didn't realize I got the same one. So now I got two of the cinnamons. And I'm too lazy to go return it. So I guess I'm going to be doing the giveaway, honey. So if you like these highlights. So I was trying to get y'all details on the giveaway. And camera got full again. This is the worst video ever. <laughs> this is the worst video ever. I am doing horrible. Oh well. Oh well. The party, the show, it must go on. So, anyways, details about the giveaway. So, like I said, I got two of these highlighters and I'm going to give one away. So, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel, go to my YouTube page, um, follow me on. I said my YouTube page. <laughs> I'm doing horrible. Go to my Instagram page, follow me on Instagram, and comment on the picture that I have um, with this look, and put your name and just say, girl, 
that glow it's popping like i'm trying to tell y'all and now that i have this to carry on my purse they messed up because i can just see me now on a date i just pull this out like he'll be talking to me i'm bored i'm like mm-hmm what kind of dudes i like um i don't even know but this glow <laughs> but yes so go down so make sure you subscribe one subscribe to my channel right now two go on my instagram page and look for the picture of this look um and it'll also say giveaway in the caption and below just write girl that glow and i'll be picking the winner by the end of next week and i'll be contacting you through instagram so good luck ladies can't wait um but last thing i got from them was the fenty glow um lip gloss yeah i'm not gonna lie i already tried the lip gloss it's a pretty pretty lip gloss like it's really really pretty hey i wanted to do it go no it's not magnet <laughs> that was so stupid but it's a really pretty lip gloss i love the smell of it but um when i put it on i was like hmm it's just a lip gloss. It's not nothing that um, I couldn't get or anywhere else with any other collection. Or it's not something that I don't have already. But I'm going to show you guys how it looks. Yeah, when my camera decided to um, say it was full again. I'm going to go ahead and hook my little wig up. Put on my accessories because it's time for me to go. Anyway. Okay, I line my lips. Kind of put on a lot, but whatever. This is a sheer gloss, so. Okay, I put on a lot. Yeah, I love this lip gloss. It kind of reminds me, like I was saying, of lip gloss when you was a kid. Like when you used to have all the lip glosses like this and all you did in high school. You weren't even a kid. This depends on how old you were. I was in high school and all I did was all the time kept them lips popping. That's when my lip gloss was popping. My lip gloss is cool. Something, something, something. Catch me after school. <laughs> I don't know the song. But yeah, these remind me of those. It has a pretty glow to it. So it goes with her whole glowing look. Um, this is something that I would keep in my purse. It has shimmers in it. And I can, and when I do like that, I can feel a little bit of the shimmers. I really can. But I don't mind it. It's not a bad lip gloss. Um, it smells really good. And... I'm trying to see can I taste it because you know when you used to have these back in high school you could taste them but I don't really taste nothing but when my sister tried it yesterday she said she she could taste it but it smells so good like see I can wear this collection on a date because honey I'll be feeling myself like I'm telling you He'd be like, girl, with this girl, stop it with the lip gloss. And I'd be like, you worry about the lip gloss player. You should be worried about this glow. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little, <laughs> okay, y'all, I'm done, I'm done. So let me give y'all my final thoughts on this whole collection overall i think rihanna did a good job um i love that she came in came through came in whatever you want to say she came through for the brown girls like i know it's crazy but sometimes my shade is not even available so i'm like what about the girls that's darker than me and then sometimes when i get my shade you make me feel like I hang I have a whole bunch of diverse diverse friends and sometimes they ask me questions like you know what you get like the last color and I'm like that is so rude but I'm like yeah I kind of did get 
the last color that they had. That mean that makes me feel like I'm really, really, really dark. I'm like, I'm I'm not. I mean, I don't care. Cause I am beautiful, honey. Let this melon come through. But still, I'm like, dang. What about my sisters? But yeah, it's like I got my color and then it was still colors behind me. So I'm like, yes, Rihanna. Yes. Rihanna came through with the 40 shades. She came through for everybody, every race. Um, so yes, Rihanna, you definitely did your thing with that. And a lot of the beauty companies need to um look into that. Or Rihanna, girl, just go ahead and dominate then. Just dominate. But, um, yeah, so as far as the foundation goes, I don't have to have it. So, I don't know if I'll really, really be adding it into my collection. I'm going to play with the samples that I have a little bit more. And if when I run out, you know how you be still reach for something? If I still notice I really, really want it, then I'm going to go on ahead and um, get it. But I don't have to have the foundation but it is really, really good foundation. I did like it. Um, it does go with my skin. Um, and I told you there's a shade out there for everyone. Like you already know. Because that's what everybody's been talking about with this collection. When it comes to her um, trio. I do like the trio. Because I told you if you're going to get one of the highlighters. And your highlighter color that you're going to get. And your um, contour color. If the contour color, if you're going to get a contour stick. And so if the highlighter and the contour color you're going to get is both in that trio, then it's cheaper for you to get the trio. Because the trio is $52 and one alone is $24. And um, it's like you get the concealer stick for free, whether you use it or not. Um, So yeah. I think that those are really good. Like I do like the um, contour stick and I love these highlighter sticks. You already know that. You already know I'm going to be singing this little light of mine. I'm going to let it shine because I'm going to be carrying these in my purse. This is going to be in my purse. So you might as well say these my travel highlighters. Um, it's not a highlighter that I think I'll reach for all the time because I still have my favorites. But I'm definitely until the summer end and when I'm going out I'm definitely going to be grabbing these and especially for my body like I'm going to be <laughs> highlighting it up because I love off the shoulder tops um if you see in one of my last videos mm -hmm, I'm trying to hint hint but you can go watch my last video um that I love off the shoulder tops so I think these are perfect to put all over your body and they don't really transfer a lot so I think that's really really cute cool too um i did see her other highlighters i wasn't a fan of that trophy wife one i think um that's for the makeup gurus i don't think i could just walk around with that trophy wife that yellow on me like um i don't know how to do my makeup like that like i'm not that that good yet i can't pull that off that's too much for me um but it is really pretty and i did like some of the other highlights but like i said it was nothing different than what i already seen um and then the lip gloss it's good if you're just a lip gloss type of girl it's good to have in your collection but if um i don't have to have this as well but it is really 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 pretty to have in your collection like to sit all of this right there like that that's bomb like here so definitely go check out her line um it's definitely something in there for everyone um it's a natural glowy look that's why i think she was going with this whole line so if you like that natural glow look which i do because i'm the everyday type of girl i don't even wear eyeshadow i don't even know how to put on my lashes so you know I'm like the everyday girl. So I love an everyday glow. And I always love for my melon to look like it's popping. So you definitely need to go check out Rihanna collection. Like I'm sure it'll be something in there that you love. So let me go ahead and just wrap this up. Make sure y'all like this video. <laughs> Even though I was everywhere this video was horrible. 
Um, make sure y'all like the video. Subscribe to my channel. I promise if you go watch my last videos, all my videos are not like this. I am not everywhere. I probably won't do any more beauty videos. I'll stick to hair and fashion. And um, yeah, subscribe to my channel. And go check out my social media. And come back um, next week because <laughs> I say this all the time. I will have another video posted. I'm gonna get that watch. One day I'm gonna surprise y'all. Y'all gonna look on here and I am gonna have that video on time. And it starts now. It starts now. I'm gonna have that video on time. Y'all tune in next week. <laughs> Bye, ladies.